it's back to school time. And it's not just our kids who are starting classes this month. We've got three opportunities for you to grow through classes in the coming weeks at Memorial. The first is a special study from Pastor Charlie. He has had so many requests to have another offering of that class that he developed on the Bible and human sexuality. Many people who have taken this conversation-based class have felt like they now have a better and deeper understanding of the scope of scriptural interpretation and theological thinking around matters of human sexuality. Now, in this iteration of the class, Pastor Charlie will have a special session outlining the actions of the recent United Methodist Church General Conference and what they mean for the local church. So if you're one of those people who's been waiting for another opportunity to take that class, I have good news for you. You can join Pastor Charlie in this study on Wednesday nights at 6 p.m. in the Maxwell Hall gathering space beginning August 28th. This six-week class is in person and will be a discussion format allowing time for your questions and childcare will be available per request. Again, that class begins Wednesday, August 28th at 6 p.m. Sign up at mumconline.com slash sign up or call the church office. And of course, if you have any questions, you can contact Pastor Charlie. Now, also beginning soon, Pastor Rachel is offering a class called Bible Stories You Learned or Didn't Learn in Childhood. This is a deeper dive into some familiar and maybe not so familiar stories from the Bible. What can we learn from them? How can we apply them to our lives today? And why were they included in the Bible in the first place? Her class will be Wednesdays at 6.30 p.m. in the Multipurpose Room beginning September 4th. And also, child care is available by request. And the Making Sense of the Bible class was moved back a few weeks to allow more people to join in. So you can still sign up for that. Join Jeff Aldridge for this look at Adam Hamilton's book. This is a great class for longtime Methodists and people new to the faith as well. The class is over Zoom, so it's also a great opportunity for our digital congregation. The class begins Tuesday, August 20th at 7 p.m. via Zoom. RSVP online or call the church office to receive your Zoom link. There's some books in the front office or you can buy one from your favorite bookseller. With summer ending, it's time for us to get back into the rotation of one of our favorite traditions here at Memorial. It's the good old-fashioned church potluck. Yes, and we have another one coming up next week, and it's a special one. Get those favorite potluck dishes ready for Sunday, August 18th. We'll join together in Maxwell Hall at 12.15 p.m., share a meal, and celebrate Karen Schmidt, who is retired as our membership coordinator. Potlucks are so much fun. It's not just about great food and great conversation and celebrating a beloved church member. It's also a great time to meet other people from Memorial. You know, those people who go to a different service than you do. Remember, Memorial, we provide the main dish, so you bring a side, a salad, or dessert to share. You can bring Karen well wishes and cards as well. There'll be a basket for that there, too. That's Sunday, August 18th at 1215 in Maxwell Hall. Now, with Karen retiring, we have welcomed Andy Foote into the position of membership coordinator. And it's perfect timing, too, because our next new member class begins next week. We have brought over 35 new members into Memorial in 2024. All those new members took our informative new member class where they learned more about Christian history, the United Methodist Church, life at Memorial, and what it means to be a member. Maybe you're feeling that nudge that it's time to take that class. Join us beginning next Sunday, August 18th at 9.30 a.m. There is still time to sign up by visiting mumconline.com slash sign up or by calling the church office. And if you have any questions, be sure to contact Andy Foote. Growing as a deeply rooted disciple through classes and studies, celebrating Karen at our potluck, and taking the steps to become a member of the church. These are just three things that you can do to live your calling through Memorial.